Hey y'all, you're watching Forty's Garage. The cold doldrums of winter here are coming. That means this beast has got to go into hibernation. So in order to try and keep things as safe as possible while that's happening, I picked up this, which is the absolute cheapest car cover I could find on Amazon. Let's check it out. Start with a little unboxing, or I guess in this case it's unbagging. Got another bag here. And a third bag, really protecting the protective cover here. And this looks like our car cover. So this is a Morian Ray. Mor Morian your Ray. I don't know, size XXL. It's supposed to be just barely fitting this Fleetwood. And it came in at a grand total of $39.99. Let's see if we got enough material to cover this boat. Looks like it might work. There's only one way to find out. So before I go ahead and strap this onto the Fleetwood out there, this, for such a cheap car cover, did make some pretty crazy claims. And one of those is that it's scratch resistant. Even in the picture, it shows someone taking a car key to the side of the cover, and it's not supposed to leave a scratch or anything. I obviously don't want to try that on anything that is nicely painted, but this door is going gone. Because as you can see, a little bit of rust issue here. So I figured, let's try it out. Put that claim to the test and see if it really is scratch resistant. So let's give it a shot. So right here on the car cover, that's where I was scraping at it. It did damage the cover a little bit, but not a scratch to be found on the door. Hopefully nobody's keying my car while it has a cover on it, but if they do, I'm protected. Let's get this sucker on. So here's how we're looking so far. I mean, it's covering the whole car. I did have to play around with it a little bit and I found out that whatever way it's facing seemed to work better on the car. So, looking pretty good. The only issue I have found so far is through these little wind straps. We got one back here, one in the middle and one up front. The little clip thing has been totally crushed. I'm gonna see if I can bend that back into place and we'll clip it on and hopefully this stays on during some gale force winds. Well, there it is. It fits pretty snug, but it seems like it's staying on there. Kind of windy today. A little baggy in spots, but that's not gonna hurt anything. As for the actual cover itself, I mean, it's pretty thin material. It kind of feels like a nice garbage bag, but it hasn't ripped under the pressure of my antenna. And it also hasn't ripped under the pressure of the hood ornament, which as we know is pretty sharp on the top. Last thing I wanna test here are the orange bits in the back and the front, it's supposed to be reflective. So if you're parked on a street or something, you know, people could tell that there's a car there. We'll test that once the sun goes down and see how that works. Well, they are technically reflective, not a lot of surface area, but hey, it's better than a sharp stick in the eye. Well, there you have it. The Morgan Ray cheapest car cover I could find on Amazon that will fit a giant 94 Cadillac Fleetwood. My honest review of this, I'd say out of all of the car covers that exist, this is certainly one of them. It's not concourse quality. This is not fancy. I just hope that it doesn't get ripped apart in the winds and the rains and the snow of the coming season here. So we'll see what happens, you know? Hey, if you like what you saw, hit us the like, subscribe. We got plenty more content like this coming and thanks for watching.